If you've been looking for a solution where you can create your MVP very quickly, look no further than Marbleism. This is a platform where you can go from zero to one within minutes. Now, this is for ones that are familiar with some kind of fundamentals with coding. If you are a no-coder and you do not understand APIs or integrating different backends, you will not be able to use this platform to the full. Let's just be honest. This is allowing you to speed up your production, but if you do have that background or have that aspiration to learn more about coding, you could be using Marbleism. So let's just take a look at what it is and look at what we created in just a few minutes. If you want to see the full video, let me know down in the comment section down below. I did a full breakdown, but this is an overview of my experience and what happened. So if you want to see that, the good and the bad, let me know in the comment section down below. So what are some examples can you build with Marbleism? Well, there's a few. Number one, a pool sharing marketplace like Airbnb, a social app like Twitter, and a project management app like Asana. That's actually a lot of different things you could do. And those aren't small micro SaaS. Those are a lot of huge businesses that you could potentially make with Marbleism. But can you really do that? Let's take a look. So when you get started, you're going to open up your account. So you get started here. You're going to be asked to get started with a new project. I already went through this where I created this myself here. But if you click um, new project here, and then you go through the project name, project type, and then project description, it will allow you uh, to actually go through the process of creating your application. Uh, you can create one for free, but if you want to create multiple uh, projects, then it's going to cost you a little bit. Although it says, I believe in the pricing, you can do two applications. Let's see, two apps generated. Uh, for the starter pack and then five iterations um, automatically when I go through here it says this will use 50 marbles um, I'm two marbles too low so I would have to you know get some more and, and pay for the pro pack for 500 marbles for $35 and that just allows me to generate more apps and 50 iterations so I must have did something wrong and spent two marbles somewhere but anyway once you do that, you're going to be able to do the project uh, name, type, description. And if you go through the prompt best practices, it breaks down how you're going to describe the application that you want. I took a few minutes and did this in a Word document and asked ChatGPT for a couple details of what I should be breaking down. I generated it and then I put it in this breakdown. And again, if anyone wants to see the full video, it's about 17 minutes. I can upload it if people want it, but let me know in the comment section down below. So what does this look like once you generate it? And it takes about, I would say five to eight minutes to get all the way through this section. So what it looks like is over here when we go in. So once you log in, you're gonna be able to chat with an AI as you go through it. But right here, the preview, you can look at what it looks like right here. It's pro, uh, Pocket Empire Alpha. It gives me a test email to let's sign in and see what happens. So I can close here. Let's just say never. And then see search top tools. So as a user, you can search a database of top tools on the homepage so that you can find tools to build and grow your business. So it came out with a couple different tools. I can click on the tool, let's see what happens. And then it becomes uh, a detailed version of that tool right there. I can upvote or downvote right here. If I say tools details, so there's telling me the tool details right here. If I say home, I get taken back to the list. Not bad, not too bad. This is what I asked it to do. Subscription page, let's see about subscriptions. I wanted a, uh, a page where, yeah, oh, cool, okay. Subscribe and manage your payments. See, add subscription. Let's see what it does. Okay, let's say if I want it from here to like next month. Let's see what it does. Then add subscription. Okay, cool. So it adds a subscription. I can delete it. Very cool. Very interesting. Also made a logo for me. It shows that I'm in the admin version right here. I have notifications and then I have a profile. 
see what happens. Yep. And then it's a profile of who I am, everything like that. Pretty interesting. Pretty interesting. So, I mean, it did what I asked. If we look at the prompt, I said that I wanted it to be a SaaS, a, a SaaS platform to access a database of best tools I can use to build my business. I want to monetize the micro SaaS, so I need the platform to have a user login function, a page to make payments for subscriptions. I broke down the pages that I wanted in the features. I said, right here, user login, user profile page, subscription page to make to take payments, homepage to search a database of top tools, upvote, downvotes for tools, detail page for each tool. That is pretty great. I also said allow users to create a new tool, allow users to search through different tools with different filters. I'm not sure if I added that detail. I think those were more of like secondary things I wanted. I don't think I added that when I first did it. But as we can see in the preview, uh, it did just that. I'm actually pretty stunned. Um, if you look at the video, if anyone wants to see it, originally when I had it generate the first time I got an error and it said to, you know, log out or you could do a bunch of different things, but came back in and automatically it was right there. Pretty interesting. So we have the preview here. Then we have the editor back here. And this is definitely so like if you're familiar with like uh, VS Code, and this is what I mentioned a lot of times, this isn't going to be something that you're just going to be able to do if you're an, a non-technical founder or just using no-code tools. You do need to be for proficient or know the structure of coding to really take advantage of this. Um, and then we have logs here, mail. This is just... I am I am impressed. I'm I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm I'm impressed. Uh, I want to know more and try out more things right here. Uh, we have the home page right here. We we have its structure and everything. I'm pretty impressed right now. But um, I'm gonna dig a little bit deeper. I'm gonna have to see. Okay, this is great. But what if I wanted to add APIs involved with this? What do I do? What's the mechanics of this? Well, that's what I'm gonna have to uh, you know really go into the details of the documentation but for a mock-up to create something like that within you know 25 minutes i think this is really special i think this is really special if people want to see me do more details on this and talk about marbleism more and see what we can come up with let me know and if you want to try it out for yourself there's a link down below to check out marbleism if you like these kind of videos i do this every single week i'll see you in the next video